Okay, this will be a um, problem, just a refresher on long division. And off to the side I have the steps to just remind you that you divide, then multiply, then subtract, and then carry down, and then you cycle through those four steps over and over again until you have nothing left to carry down. So I'm going to set this up and walk through it. Okay, so your first step, um, first and foremost, note I didn't have any x squared, so I put in a 0x squared. But the first step is to divide, and you're always dividing your first terms only. So I'm going to take 2x to the fourth divided by x, and that is um, 2x cubed. And that goes up top. So 2x cubed. And then your multiply step is to multiply this times the entire um, dividend. So 2x cubed times x is 2x to the fourth, and 2x cubed times 4 is 8x cubed. And then we subtract, and this is the tricky step that usually I see mistakes occur, so you subtract all the way through, and what I do is I change this to plus, and then I carry a negative all the way through. So 2 minus 2 cancels out, negative 3 minus 8 is negative 11x cubed. And then we carry down. So the next term to carry down is that 0x squared. And now I'm back to dividing again. So I divide my new first term essentially divided by x again. So negative 11x cubed divided by x is negative 11x squared. So that goes up top, again, minus 11x squared, and then I multiply. So negative 11x squared times x is negative 11x cubed. Negative um, 11x squared times 4 is negative 44x squared. And I'm going to squish this up. And then I subtract. So I'm subtracting all of this, and again I change that to plus, and then I negate everything inside. So negative 11 plus 11 cancels out, 0 plus 44 is 44x squared, and then I carry down, so plus 2x, and I'm ready to divide again. So my new first term, 44x squared divided by x is 44x, so that goes up top. So plus 44x, and I multiply. So 44x times x is 44x squared. Um, 44x times 4 is 176x. And I subtract, or change that to a plus and change the signs. And 44 minus 44 cancels out. 2 minus 176 is negative 174x. And I finally get to carry down my last piece, minus 5. And my last division is um, negative 174 divided by x. And I'm not going to write that off to the side, but if I take this divided by x, it's just going to cancel out the x. So it's minus 174. And let's see if I can squeeze this in and... So minus 174x, and so 174 times x is negative 174x, and negative 174 times 4 is negative 696. And then I'm going to subtract all of that, and I'm really going to change that to plus and then negate everything. And 696 minus 5 is 691. Okay, and I'm going to just scooch back up here. So 691 is my remainder, so I write that plus 691 divided by whatever I'm dividing by, my divisor of x plus 4. And that is your final answer.